Hi everybody. This morning um, I ran out of kitchen and bathroom cleaner and I need to clean <laughs> my sinks upstairs. So um, I'm going to mix some more bathroom cleaner up using just vinegar, water, and essential oils and I'm going to show you how to do it. Um, so let's get started. So I start out with a glass bottle just like this one and I already have it labeled so that I don't mix it up. Um, and the first thing I'm gonna do is fill it half full with white vinegar. Now, white vinegar, um, you can actually just clean with white vinegar and water. It really is fine. I'm gonna try not to make a mess. But I like to add essential oils to it um, to give it more, it gives it a good smell because vinegar is kind of pungent. It can be, at least. Uh-oh, we're out. Oh look, it's a brand new bottle. Okay. So let's fill it up halfway. This is a 16 ounce bottle. I got it um, either on Amazon or Jet.com. I don't totally remember. I've gotten from both. Um, and what we're gonna do is we are going to start adding our oils now. Um, to start off, I need 15 drops of rosemary, rosemary essential oil. And I can't open it, so there we go. We're open now, sorry about that. So I'm gonna put 15 drops of rosemary in here. And then, let's set that off to the side. I'm gonna add 15 drops of tea tree oil. Boop -a -doo -doo. All of my oils come from Plant Therapy, um, so you can check out their website. It's planttherapy.com. They sell all kinds of 100% pure essential oils. So that was 15 drops of tea tree oil. Um, next, we are going to go to 10 drops of lemon essential oil. This kind of gives it a fresh smell. And of course this one won't come open either. Hold on. All right, we're good to go now. So this is gonna be 10 drops of lemon. That one came out really, really fast. Some of them do. These are my used oils over here. Next is five drops of lavender. Lavender has um, some cleaning properties to it and it also adds a nice smell. So it's not so mm, in your face, I guess. And then, this is not on the recipe that I found, but cinnamon bark oil ha is so good for um, it, bacteria and everything like that. So um, I'm gonna add 10 drops of this. This is pretty potent. It has quite the smell to it. You can definitely tell it's cinnamon. Okay, so that was 10 drops of cinnamon. When I teach my first graders how to say synonym, cinnamon always comes out. And then we're gonna top it off with some distilled water up to the top and then make sure you shake it before you use it. So that is a super easy way to make um, kitchen and bathroom cleaner. I use it on my kitchen countertops, my bathroom sink, um, all over the toilet and um, it's it doesn't have any toxic chemicals but it cleans really really well so I encourage you to give it a try I'm gonna have a blog post um, coming 
uh, with the recipe for this pretty soon. Um, you can find that on ruralhighness.com. Um, so be sure to check that out. And thank you so much for watching and have a fantastic day.